Good morning, everybody. It's Thursday morning, and I know not even one of you is surprised that I'm driving through snow right now. I wouldn't call this a blizzard quite yet, but it's flurries, right? So we're not even gonna talk about it. We're just gonna act like it's sunshine and rainbows outside. Palm trees everywhere. There's a beach right over there, you see it? Nice warm ocean water with no sharks. No jellyfish and nothing else that wants to kill you nearby. You can go for a swim if you want. There's a tiki bar over there. It's an open bar. It's beautiful outside. It's not snowing at all. We're at an all-inclusive resort in Mexico. I'm not in a truck in the snowstorm. I don't know what you're talking about. Dreamland is fun. Much more fun than this. So everybody, I've got some big news. You're gonna, you're gonna laugh. We're going up north again. I have a load waiting for me in the yard that's going to northern Manitoba. But the good news is that there's no, no ferries. And I checked the forecast. It's supposed to snow overnight, but no winter storm warning. And it's supposed to be cleared up by morning. We're going to Snow Lake, Manitoba. And it's all paved roads all the way there. We checked. So let's hope that the weatherman is right for once and that there is no, <laughs> that I'm not gonna get stuck up there again. I know it looks kind of windy, blustery. It is windy, but the roads at least aren't slippery. You got some dry pavement right down there under the snow. Still gotta be careful, be alert, but at least we're not dealing with ice with all of this wind. We're headed west right now, so you see that wind just rushing over the highway. That wind is coming from the north, and I'm sure it's coming all the way from the Hudson's Bay north of Manitoba. And that's going to bring along some cold winter air for the next couple of days. When I get up to Snow Lake tonight, it's supposed to be minus 16 Celsius. So a little chilly. What is minus 16 Celsius in Fahrenheit? Minus 16 degrees Celsius is equivalent to 3.2 degrees Fahrenheit. That's the weather we're going into tonight, and that cold air is coming down from the north. We all knew this season was coming, so let's just get through it. Summertime's around the corner, right? It's just around the corner. It's just, it's just got to get through winter.
I'm north of Winnipeg right now on Highway 6, heading up towards Snow Lake, Manitoba. I've still got about six hours of driving to go. I'm hoping that I can make it there tonight yet. Uh, the days are kind of short right now, the daylight hours. So it's dark outside already. But the time is seven o'clock in the evening. And uh, I'll show you our load behind us here. If you can see it. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Let's go look at it from the other side. Have a little bit of light coming off the street lights that way. We're at the Esso in Ericsdale, Manitoba. Gas is at a dollar sixty point nine here. Is it that cheap down in Steinbeck too? Last I checked, it was like a dollar eighty or a dollar seventy or something. Stein. Is it cheaper up here? That's strange right usually it's more expensive up here so we got these pipes up here a couple of boxes a couple of bars it's just a little bit of mismatch this a little bit of that one crate here at the end and my tarps i know you can't really see so. i have to show you it in the morning before we unload i don't want to waste too much time here i've got a long way to go yet We made it to Northern Manitoba, Snow Lake. And guess what? I don't want to talk too soon, but we didn't wake up in a snowstorm. We got our trailer unloaded first thing in the morning here. Got it reloaded right at the same spot. So my backhaul is right here, which is awesome. So I don't even have to go and pick anything up and I don't have to go back empty. So I'm all loaded up now, tied down, a little bit cold, but that's okay. Just my face. The rest of me is sweating. Thanks for watching today, everybody. A little bit of a short video, but we went a long ways. It was just mostly at night. I was really tired by the time we got here. But now it's time to go home. I'll see you in tomorrow's vlog. Don't forget to like the videos. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you want to see more of and let me know where you are. See you later. <laughs>